The world's about to end. The world's about to end. To, 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 to end. So I'm chilling with a female friend one day and she's telling me how it's hard for her to get new relationships because she still hasn't completely gotten over her ex. But when we start talking, she's like, well, I would be open for an open relationship or whatever. Personally, I don't think that's a good idea for her because she's really, really still into him. We end up like, you know, kissing a little bit. So then she uh, says, well, maybe you and me should be in an open relationship. Not to be mean or anything, but... I don't think that's a good idea. If we're gonna be in any kind of relationship at all, I don't wanna be in one where I'm only getting part of you. I want to have access to all of you, even if it's not at the beginning. She looks at me and goes, oh, okay. I'll be in a relationship with you, but I'm not having sex with you. That is the most bull thing I've ever heard in my life. That is a very selfish decision. I want to say right now, before this goes any further, I'm not that kind of dude who gets into a relationship with a girl just for sex. I'm not that kind of dude. I get in a relationship with a girl for the person. If a person tells me that they are a virgin and they're saving themselves for marriage, I completely respect that. If a person tells me that they want to take things slow and not do anything physical, I respect that. I respect those decisions. But this girl already been knocking boots. Hot ass beat clap. Hot ass beat clap. You can't go in a relationship saying what you're already not gonna do. Let's think about it like this real quick. Ladies, what if I told you, oh, uh, we, can, we can go out, yeah, we can be boyfriend and girlfriend, but uh, I ain't about to buy you nothing. What you looking at me for? You hungry? Psh. Girl, I already got my food. You better. What the purse at? I don't give a damn if it is your birthday. Oh, oh, oh. You want something to unwrap. You want something. All right, let me see right here. See this right here? Fresh pack of gum. Here you go, girl. Be careful with that. It got layers. You see how messed up that is? Nobody should go into a relationship expecting things. Girls shouldn't go into a relationship expecting money. We call those gold diggers. Dudes shouldn't go into relationships expecting sex. Because they do. They only want you for sex. I get it. But you can't start out saying that you're not going to do this, you're not going to do that. I don't, I, I just, I keep wondering how these girls find me. I don't go out looking for them. They like, they appear in my life. Like I'll be somewhere dancing or somewhere chilling with my friends and they'll walk up. Wow, your shirt is red. I like red too. And that's how you do it. Okay, let's think we should talk. Ladies, please take this as a note. Have standards. Respect yourself. Have your no's and your yeses in order. But if you're willing to share yourself in a relationship with somebody, then you can't limit anything. Yes, respect yourself, but also respect the other person enough not to say stupid stuff like that. Just what? You dumb as f uh, I do a few of these uh, talk videos a year while I try to. I don't really put a lot of them up because. I don't know, this feels like nobody's watching. Like I did one of these last time, I think I only got like 25 views. <laughs> so one, if you like this, like this video, not only on Facebook, but like it on YouTube as well. I don't really know what it does, but I hear other YouTubers say it. Two, share the video with your friends. Say bye, Mickey. Say bye, say, say bye. He's not gonna say it. He's not gonna say it. Hiya, bitch. What the fuck?